my name is Velma and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my new series. I'm going to be starting a new series where this is going to be a week full of videos. I'm going to be uploading one video a day up until Valentine's Day. So, And we're going to be calling it February Heart Week. So yeah, it's just going to be full of fun and laughter and also if you're against Valentine's Day then maybe there will be a video for you, I'm pretty sure. So go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below so that you can see more videos from me. And yeah, hope you guys are ready to enjoy this full week of just love. Love. So yeah, I kind of just wanted to sit on my couch and we're just going to have a full week of fun Valentine's Day videos. So you can't hate on these videos. You cannot. The dislike button is just not here this week, you know, like it, it's on vacation. So if you want to hit it, just wait for the week to finish and then come back when I upload um, a non-Valentine video and then hit dislike all you want. So you're just not allowed to do it this week. So I hope you're okay with that because you're going to have to be okay with that. Okay, so, so today we're going to be talking about Valentine's Day facts. I find these very like interesting and I'm just very like I'm a very easy mind blown type of person like you can blow my mind real quick <laughs> like just I don't know I'm very interested in things and like people and just things like I'm interested so without further ado today I'm going to be sharing 10 weird facts about Valentine's Day so did you know that you're more likely to fall in love with somebody that you share the same lung capacity the same ear size and the same middle finger length like <laughs> oops like i'm just gonna flip everybody off i should just go around and be like who's my match let me see your finger why did i not know this before like i need to go find my match like this i'm gonna be like come here maybe you're for me all right weird fact number two so being in love creates a neurological response identical to the effects of cocaine <sighs> Where has my drug been? Just kidding. <laughs> and I kind of see that. Like, I love the feeling of being in love. Like, sex put aside, you know, attraction put aside, everything. Like, just somebody that really makes you feel in love. And when you feel in love, like, you feel that something, you know? Like, you know what I'm talking about. You just feel that one thing and it just feels amazing and you always want to have it forever and I think that's why I'm crazy and I just want to be loved. I, I need affection like 24-7 and maybe I'm addicted to cocaine. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Number three, did you know by staring in a stranger's eyes, as weird as that sounds and as creepy as hell as that may be, that it can get them to fall in love with you? Girl, if I knew this, I'm gonna go and like, like they can fall in love with you if you stare into their eyes. How is that? Like, I'm gonna go to work tomorrow and I'm gonna be like, I'm just kidding, <laughs> I'm just kidding. But like, how cool, huh? Like, it's just crazy how how your mind works, how how everything is, I don't know. It's just kind of mind blown. Number four, women prefer smelling sweat of men whose immune systems are differently than theirs. I don't know, isn't that crazy how love has like, a, I don't know, that's just crazy. And I really don't think smelling anybody's sweat is attractive. <laughs> a girl, I don't know what you're doing, like quit smelling that guy, but I don't know. Okay, the next one is looking at a picture of your beloved one can actually alleviate pain. Like it can actually cause your brain to feel like you have taken an ibuprofen, some Tylenol, whatever you may take, and it just makes you feel better, like you feel you can automatically stop pain. How, what? That's crazy. Okay, next one. It takes only four minutes to know that you like someone. Like, how crazy? I'm trying to think. It only takes four minutes for you to realize like, hey, I like you, you okay. You're potential. You can stay, you can, you may be my Valentine. So that's crazy, like four minutes. Why would it take just four minutes? Then the average man spends nearly 43 minutes a day staring at 10 different women. Girl, why? Why do men have to be cheaters? Why can't they just look at one beautiful woman for 43 minutes a day? Like, why does it have to be 10? I wonder if girls, how many guys girls look at? 
how many guys girl does that make sense am i making sense i don't think so but yeah four minutes i think i'm gonna need a little longer but yeah they stare at 10 different women like no wonder like hmm this better not be true because i'm gonna be hurt being in love causes couples heartbeats to synchronize i feel like i've heard this one before kind of like the whole cat situation if you have anxiety, you can lay your cat on your chest and they calm you down, supposedly. I may be totally wrong, don't quote me on that one, but yeah. So listen to this one. The face, not the body, because ain't nobody falling in love with my body, <laughs> um, is the most common determinant, what? Determinant of attraction. Like, I guess guys fall in love with their face. Ooh, I'm so out of focus. So supposedly, you know, they fall in love more with the face rather than the body. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. And the last weird fact is that men say I love you way before the woman does, which I believe, I feel like that's very true. I mean, like I've been in situations where I'm like, damn, I should really like just tell him that I love him and maybe it'll make things happen or maybe you know it'll speed things up or maybe just whatever but for whatever reason i think that but um yeah i would never like I, i've never been able to do it first i don't know if it's just something like our mothers instilled in us that we're like no the guy he needs to do this you know whatever i think that's about 10 weird facts i'm not too sure on the number i just kind of threw them out but i thought they were pretty interesting pretty fun to just talk about and I thought I would share them with you guys for the first day of, what did we call it? February Heart Week. Anyway, on a serious note, like I feel that these videos are going to be very fun for you guys because whether you're all for Valentine's Day or whether you're one of those people that are like, oh my god, like um, if you love somebody, you should tell them you love them every day and not just on Valentine's Day. Whatever. Like you, if you're one of those type of persons, it doesn't matter. Um, I feel like one of these videos will be fitting, they'll be funny, they'll be easy, and yeah, I'm kind of excited. I really, 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 really love Valentine's Day. I love hearts, like the shapes, the colors, like it's almost like Christmas to me. It gives me like, I don't know, I have a lot of nostalgia when it comes to, uh, to Valentine's Day, like I don't know. But anyway, so I'm going to be sharing some videos with you, with you guys. I'm going to be talking about my first Valentine. Um, just kind of giving you a sneak peek of what the week has to come. There will be a story time where I talk about my first Valentine ever, like the first card I ever gave to a boy. Um, I'm going to be talking about how, so if you're going to be alone, let's be alone together and hit the subscribe button and I'll be here for you girl. You don't need no man. But yeah, so that's it guys. I'm going to go ahead and let you go because I know it looks like shit and I think it's time to go to bed. Yeah, I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!